New school emergency response system going live today in Blunt County. Back in September, uh, county officials told us about Sarah, a situational awareness technology helping reduce response times to emergency situations at local schools. Well, today we got a look at the alert system in action for the first time. New here at 5 WATE 6 on your side reporter Kirsty Crawford seeing the system firsthand and shows us now how it works. It all starts with this pendant. Every staff member will have one and with a press of a button, this whole place goes on lockdown and law enforcement will be watching. We've got a location, we've got the need and we're sending help just that fast. Every middle and high school teacher and staff will get one of these pendants. It's part of the situational awareness technology called SARA. James Long, the Blount County 911 Communications Director, says the goal is immediate response to any emergency at schools. As soon as the, someone alerts this thing, whether it be by pendant or the, the computer screen, by pushing a button on their computer, we're getting it in, in, as you saw demonstrated in less than seconds. The pendant is only used in the event of a serious threat, but every faculty desktop will have buttons for other emergencies, such as a fight, fire, or medical issue. No matter which button is pressed, an alert is sent to the 911 center with critical information, who pressed it, where they are, and they'll also have a visual account of what's going on through a live camera feed. Not only do they have that pop-up camera, they have access to all the cameras in the school, so they can follow the situation as it moves and know exactly where people are at and exactly what's going on. The alert is also sent to all faculty desktops in the schools and SRO radios. Both Don Stallion, the Blount County Director of General Services, and Long say the new system is a game changer that's been five years in the making. Today is only the starting point of how Sarah can keep Blount County students and families safe. We like being on the cutting edge when we can be, and technology is something that's ever changing. And if you don't keep up with it, then you're behind. You know, if you're not thinking about tomorrow, you're not doing your job. This pendant is live. If I press this right now, the 911 center would be notified. That means any accidental press will initiate a lockdown. Even though that's a possibility, they say they'd rather be safe than sorry. Reporting in Blunt County, Kirsty Crawford, WATE 6 on your side. Thank you, Kirsty. Now, Blunt County officials say that use of the new alert system is possible largely through a state grant. Government buildings will also have these kinds of alert systems, but employees won't have those pendants that Kirsty showed us. They will have only the desktop version.